I've always liked <laughs> the surprise of not knowing what's under the tree and all that. My name is Chris Willis, and I like to think of myself as a perpetual creative. 350 bulbs, one at a time. Finding the unusual in the usual. There's definitely a huge nostalgia component to this whole display and my whole obsession with collecting these things. It's almost kind of like trying to recapture and hold on to that childhood warm, fuzzy feeling that I had, you know, with my grandmother's um, display. And yeah, that's the one that started it all. She knows where this led to. Yeah, I would definitely say it snowballed. <laughs> Here's where they all kind of, all kind of live. 25 Santas per bag. I thought it'd be fun to kind of see how many of these I could collect in one year. I think it was 150 I got, and that was in my first storefront. Just been growing the collection ever since. Eight years later, there's over 350 of these. Wheeler, Oregon. It's like each one of them has their own character, their own kind of personality. McKeesport, Pennsylvania. They do come from all over the country. Rock Island, Illinois. I usually, when I get a box of them, I'll write down on the bottom of each Santa kind of what state I bought them from. Baghdad, Kentucky, that's crazy. And there's even more, you know, in the boxes too. I haven't even opened those up that's yet. pretty good. I think that's when you know there's got a problem. You don't even remember buying these things. It's definitely over 350 now. A few hours on eBay and I was off and running. $10 each, that was the budget. And they, you know, come out once a year. So I give them that opportunity. Share it with everybody. I love how it's kind of taken on a life of its own. As soon as October's over and, you know, come November, I'm kind of scouting empty storefronts. In the last couple of years, I've decided instead of telling people where it's at, I've been leaving clues on my Instagram account. Okay. Oh, I'm curious. Yeah. I've been asked why I do this. I ask myself that every time I start setting this up, you know, maybe individuality, you know, and commonality, kind of some sort of social comment. But really, I think it's just like okay, doing my part. It's going to go for it. Keeping Portland weird. The issue with that, though, is like, I don't see anything weird about this. This feels totally normal to me. I think it's going to work. Do you see all those little Santas? Have you ever seen so many? Okay. Yeah, the Santa clones. <laughs> yeah, Santa Claus, Santa clones. Honoring the China's emperors, terracotta warriors, all standing in formation. There's a lot of lit up Santas here soon. Here we go. I love it. It's nice. It yeah, looks good. Yeah, it's beautiful. It just cracks me up. They're all the same, but they're all different. It's cute. It's very festive. I think my, my joy out of it is seeing the reactions of people, regardless of what sort of reaction it is. But there's always some reaction. <laughs> it's pretty cool. <laughs> it's kind of creepy, though. <laughs> kind of like the gremlins when they got wet, and they just multiplied. <laughs> Warm, fuzzy feelings. Me, anyway. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty great. <laughs>